Hello? Can you guys hear me? Yeah! yeah. yeah. Watch out the reindeer! <laughs> I pledge allegiance to the flag and to the United States of America and to the broken treaties and stolen lands for which it stands. One nation, bajo Dios, indivisible with liberty and justice for a select Caucasian few. I first heard the name Guadalupe Hidalgo, other than Miss Gonzalez's history class my junior year of high school. It took 16 years for me to understand that the soil I stand on today was once Mexican territory. But before this, the rumors of this immorality only flew past my ears as the equivalent of middle school playground soccer high school dating drama. My first thoughts upon hearing this astonishing revelation were, wait, so was I born in Mexico or not? The American education system fails to understand how difficult it is to survive in a culture so, so fixated on destroying every bit of yours. They will throw you into a dark room with no flashlight and call this learning. But this history class is not for me because this is not my history. I came home. I come home to be educated about the evils of my culture in the TV room, only to go back to school and hear no mention of it in the classroom. White pages, white paper, white walls. The American education system will bleach your vision so you can no longer see the color of your skin. For years, school taught me to feel lost at family reunions, not knowing whether I should speak Spanish because after all, we are in America, the uh. land of the free. The lands of the free, but I could not help feeling imprisoned within myself. My abuela tells me, Mijito, your bilingual tongue is your weapon. Do not be afraid to use it. Your wings are your heritage. Do not let them take your wings, for they are your only way back. Do not let them annihilate your accent. Do not let them destroy your distinctions, your distinctions are everything and they are distinctively perfect. I learned this much too late because you see when they put up these borders, they don't just build them on the outside, they go up inside you, tearing you in half. But whatever you do, whatever you do, make sure to always keep a reminder of who you are on hand because these are the United States of amnesia, a place of forgetting.